Hello Libras, this is your reading for the 21st through the 22nd. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you guys are new, welcome. Please hit the like button, share the video, and subscribe. <clears throat> I'm going to pull some energy for you guys, and then I'm going to pull from the Vice Versa Tarot to see who's actually lurking around you energetically, coming towards you energetically, and um, see what they want, all right? So let's go ahead and get started. What's going on with Libra today? What's going on with Libra? Five of Pentacles. Some of you are feeling hurt, feeling left out, feeling rejected by someone, feeling like, you know, somebody is not there for you like you are for them, even uh, Taurus energy there. The Wheel of Fortune. Um, some changes going on here. Maybe you guys you know, once felt kind of secure in a connection or a relationship with someone. Um, and, and now you're feeling like, you know, you would like to see some change in this situation, change for the better. Definitely um, some changes going on with you, within you guys, I feel. The Wheel of Fortune is all about karma. What you put in is what you get out. So definitely want to see some changes here, I feel. Then we have a King of Swords. Hmm. Definitely looks like, you know, either you or someone else is um, wanting to come out of the cold, wanting to be in somebody's good graces here, okay? This could be you wanting to get back into someone's good graces, or this could be someone else that's wanting to, you know, get back into your good graces, I feel. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, like yourself, or Taurus energy is present here, okay? Let's see what else we've got for you guys here. Uh-oh. The Page of Pentacles. Something just fell back there. Um, there's something that you are learning um, or somebody is learning about you. Maybe wants to make an apology to you, wants to say something to you. But definitely there is an interest here in, in doing something new, something different, I feel. Okay, um, and this is possibly somebody wanting to come out of the cold with you guys, or the opposite. You want to come out, come, come out of the cold with someone else here, wanting to get back in somebody's good graces is what it's, it's looking like here. Want to make an apology, wanting to spend more time, give more time to a situation here. Then we have the star, definitely um, feeling like. You know, looking for looking for which direction you're supposed to go in. What path um, are you supposed to go down? What's good for you? Who's good for you? Even I'm feeling from you guys. Aquarius energy is here. Um, I'm feeling like somebody currently has their their back turned and it's not giving to a situation anymore. And um, but definitely somebody wants to revisit the situation and go forward here is what I'm getting. Then we have the Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn energy, Capricorn Virgo, I feel. Hmm. I'm, what I'm feeling here is that there's somebody here, whether you is the or is the other person, feels like the other person is their destiny like like you guys belong together somebody feels here that you and someone else belong together okay um but also feels like you know the other person is not receptive to how the other person feels okay hmm Let's see what this Page of Pentacles is about here for you guys. Why is a Page of Pentacles here? The Two of Swords. I'm feeling like this is you guys, honestly, because the Two of Swords is your card. And this is being indecisive, really not knowing um, for sure what your path is or who is meant for you. But I'm getting that you guys kind of have an inclination of who this person is. Uh, maybe there's something about them that you um, don't like or don't want to accept, but definitely feeling like, you know, there is some sort of 
similarity with this person, some some sort of um, camaraderie with this person to where you feel like they are meant to be in your life. Now, whether or not you guys feel like this person is meant to be with you through the duration, you know, quite possibly because we have the will of fortune there. And the will of fortune is your husband. Okay? It, it is. So, whether or not you guys actually want to be with this person or you do not, you know, particularly care for how they are or, you know, how they behave, how they react emotionally to you um, this this possibly is the person that is meant to be in your life and meant to be your husband but we all have free will so there you have it let's see what this five of pentacles is about here why is the five of pentacles here oh somebody is feeling very very hurt and feeling like someone has just almost rip their heart out of their chest is what I'm feeling here um, very attached to a situation Capricorn energy very attached to a situation um, I'm feeling like somebody feels like you guys probably are not giving as much as you could is what I'm getting here and they look at you as being very indecisive, not knowing, you know, blowing hot and cold one day, you know, you want to do this and then the next day, no, nah, I don't think so. That kind of thing. And um, they really want to spend some time with you. And I feel like this person wants to, wants to say something to you because there's something that they feel like they've learned about you guys. Okay. So let's go ahead and take a look at <clears throat> who's coming towards you. Who's coming towards Libra? Who's coming towards Libra? Please show me who's coming towards Libra. Who's coming towards Libra? Hmm. We have the Knight of Pentacles going away from the reading. Um, Taurus energy there. Somebody is not wanting to um, spend any more time here. Feeling like their time is better spent elsewhere. Okay. They still think about you though. Okay. And then we have the Queen of Wands here. Hmm. Somebody's definitely maybe Aries, Taurus, individual, somebody on the cusp. Um, they are like they're going away from the reading because they're they're wanting to initiate action um, somewhere else. They're interested in something else, starting something new. Totally, okay. Let's see. What do they want from Libra? What do they want from Libra? What do they want from Libra? Hmm. I'm feeling like there's something that they they want to to end. Um, I, I'm thinking they don't want to really be away from you. They don't want to leave away from you, but they feel like something needs to be transform something needs to be changed in this situation here something that's not working for them okay because this this death is coming back into the reading okay and there's illumination right here there's action to be taken here so this is for me is like transformation I feel okay for sure Coming back into the reading, okay? So let's see. And the Ace of Wands. Definitely, they would like to see um, some change in the situation. A new start with you even, okay? But they, they're feeling like um, somebody needs to, to hold themselves accountable for things that have happened. Whether it's you or them. But there is a accountability to be had here. Um, there are two people here. And, and maybe quite possibly both of you guys need to change here. Because there's two people right here facing um, death, endings, change. Changing things that are not working for you. Maybe there's something you guys, they want to talk about with you. That needs to change between the two of you. Or ways that both of you guys can change but definitely want to start over I feel here okay so 
this is Scorpio energy here. I think I called out all of the other signs for you guys. Taurus, um, Aquarius, Capricorn energy, Aries, and um, Scorpio. All right, guys. So that's what I have for you. And I will be speaking with you guys soon.